I think the Goldsmiths Prize is teaching us that Britain and Ireland do not just produce parochial, inward-looking fiction. W's College at the edge of Dartmoor. Students smoking in small groups. The remnants of disposable barbecues. Spread blankets and a portable MP3 player pounding out Jandek's modern dances. This is his kind of political protest, W says. W is disappointed that none of his sports science students have joined the occupation. He thought he might have been able to turn them. He thought they might have ended up on his side, armed with cricket bats and hockey sticks. But his philosophy postgraduates are out in force, W says. The last humanities students of the college, the brave remnant, the sign of righteousness on their foreheads, ready to confront the army of the Antichrist. But there is no army, only a lone security guard sitting on a plastic chair. In the Dark Ages, the monasteries were wonderfully effective at preserving knowledge. And I think in these new Dark Ages, the universities might have a similar role. I would say to anyone writing right now, the chances have never been better um, to be published if you're doing something new, um, innovative and exciting.